Hey Pisces, how are you? I hope you are well. I hope you're fine. I hope you're safe wherever you are right now. This reading for today is for the Pisces friends out there. This is a weekend reading. This is for you. What is the love opportunity in general situationship message for Pisces this weekend, okay? What is meant for you to know for this time of the day or week, all right? This is for Pisces. This is a weekend love and general situationship reading. What is the message, please, okay? Before I start, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button in the bell, please, please do it now if you are interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, Pisces, you know what to do. All of the details is down in the description box below. Okay? And all other services that I offer outside of the YouTube platform, it is in the website. So go to www.sunshine-tv.com. In there, you will see the extended reading, the private reading, and the blog. There is a full moon in Libra happening on the 28th of March, 2021. So don't forget to practice your ritual full moon routine to take advantage of the beautiful beam of the full moon um, in... Well, it's today in New Zealand, and I think in the U.S. it's tomorrow. Yeah, pretty much. So, let's start your reading, Pisces. What's the message for you in love and general situationship? What can I get for Pisces, please? What is the message? Okay. Let's start your reading. You've got the Justice card clarified by the Page of Swords in the um, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. I really feel like this is a situation about... Um, a female personality there's a female a younger female who you've been waiting for them to message you to call you to text you to confirm to you this person is taking their time i think this is a job application for some of you guys if this is not a job application you could be a mother or you could be taking care they taking taking care you're taking care of a younger female um it's like a teenager they're taking their time. Um, it is in a very delicate um, age or like rebellious stage for this teenager. If you if if this if you're resonating that you've got an issue with the teenager, um, they'll come around. Now, for some of you guys, this seems to be um, like a job offer. I don't think this is the boss, but I think they're the one who's going to confirm your interview or they're going to give you the contract or um, they're going to give you the news connected to an interview or a job offer. This is a female tiptoe. So be careful on how you follow up because they're quite busy. And I really feel like they'll find... I really feel like they will get back to you. They're just waiting for some signature as well. So take it easy. Let me just get an, yeah, three of cups. I think there would be some good news coming from this person. Give it some time. Um, I see three to four weeks uh, processing for some of you of the entire process. So look at the calendar on where you are right now. It's a three to four weeks process. I think you're going to get a job. You're going to get it. Okay. It's just the processing it takes quite um it takes it, it takes some time to, to to generate the contract or to get approval or something but it's gonna get official and the outcome is a three of cups which is celebration so that's good and for someone who is having an issue with a teenager rebellious teenager they'll come around three of cups you know they will respect you again this is you they will respect you again. You'll get the respect back from this person. I think you're penalizing them. Like they're grounded. They are learning the lesson in a hard way. They will respect you again. It seems to be everything seems to go back to normal. Then you've got the four of wands in reverse. Clarified by the five of wands in reverse. The page of wands. And you've got the eight of swords in reverse. Um... This talks about um, inability to make a decision. Um, 
you'll get some good news or there is a happy person for some of you if you've been if, like if you're single if you're single and you've been wanting to really find love or connect to a new love there is a female person you talk to this person every day you see them you talk to them casually it's like an acquaintance this person can connect you like if you drop to this person you know i'm single i'm really wanting to date they will refer you to a they have because for example this could be a barista and they've got a lot of you know they met a lot of people um in in their shop and they're very friendly and they know the people by their name so it's like talking in conversation with this person in passing yeah i've been single and i really wanted to go into the dating you know um arena again this person could connect you instantly with someone okay so four of wands five of wands it's in an, it's in your network a female personality that you interact every day i don't know it could be a bus driver or it's 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 a it's a person you see the face every day you talk to them casually for some of you and you find them really friendly in passing you will mention oh i'm recently single and i wanted to date they will instantly connect you with someone of a new love opportunity and for some of you you're struggling to decide um there's a female personality that would help you this week that would cheer you up you know like um think of a person that whenever you are with them they're like funny humorous because they'll put you in a good mood and for some reason you'll find you'll be able to make a decision one you know it's it's like have a coffee with them have a good chat have fun chit chat and then it's kind of clearing all the clog in your mind because it's it's a happy vibe it's a personality who has a happy vibe their happiness their laughter is contagious be around this people person because they're gonna help you decide they're not gonna decide for you but because you're such in a good mood you finally get that vibe courage or that clear thinking to decide so that's the second reading the third reading is you've got the empress card in reverse oh the queen of cups okay you're in love two of pentacles the queen of swords you're in love with someone there is a third party in here there's a third party you're in love don't use your heart use your brain they will message you again there is an incoming message from someone who it seems to be there was a third party or there was a multiple dating you like this person you're in love with this person you have a big heart towards this person this person's like your weakness it's like your kryptonite uh, queen of swords be very smart they will message you again okay i think this person have the same feelings towards you don't forget that you can demand okay you can tell them that if you really love me or like me if, if you want me make it right queen of sword demand make it right make me your solo person drop the third party and we can sort this out queen of swords be smart use your head over your heart look at that use your head over your heart it should be this way okay head over heart decision making all right and then um you've got the hermit card in reverse the two of wands in reverse you've got the king of pentacles You've got the two of swords hermit card the two of wands you know you better relax if if you're going if you're going to make a decision making about a holiday about a big purchase about doing something big adjustment in your life you've got a money first of all you've got a money and you can really afford to buy the car the house the gadget whatever it is that you're meaning to buy in the next two weeks but you know this is a hard earned money you have gray hair <laughs> um so take your time to decide because it's it's heavy to just release the money without thinking of it 
Do you need it now? Maybe last year or two years ago, you need it. But do you need it now? So you're going to invest into something big. You're going to use your hard-earned money. Think very carefully. Like make sure your head and your heart says yes in this decision making. Don't you don't you don't need to rush if you wanted to delay, delay it until such time that you're you're one with yourself, one with your feelings, your intuition, and one with the decision making. Okay, because you have hesitation. You know, I feel like in the next two weeks you have hesitation on you have hesitation in terms of buying, moving acquiring something hard earned money you know you 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 earn this money work hard for this money so you don't want to, that money to go to waste so take your time in terms of decision making and um the last reading is you've got a nine of cups look at that wish fulfillment clarified by the eight of wands in reverse the high priestess the seven of pentacles i think you will break free um yes when i said that 11 minutes 11 seconds you'll break free you're finally going to break free from a heartache or a contract something that is an obligation something of a responsibility you'll break free it could be the end of a very bad cycle could be an annulment could be a divorce it could be an end of a contract an end of a bad contract towards someone it could be a breakup but it's a break free breaking free from something that has shackled you for quite some time has restricted you okay so yeah this is a nice energy and it's happening in the full moon release so thank you Pisces thanks for tuning in thanks for being here I hope you liked the reading if you do don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell and I'll see you soon again bye bye